How's it going? Welcome to the channel today. Today's video is going to be applying um, a tire shine on the tires on the Jeep. We already cleaned up. We're going to be using chemical guys right here. Tire kicker, tire shine, extra shiny tire. It says uh, dry to the touch, dress them with UV blockers. And basically what I've been reading on it. I never used it before. About a little while ago and I just haven't tried it. Basically, it says uh, delivers long-lasting wet shine and protection without any greasy mess. Tire kicker is a Schrabel water-based dressing. And it gives a deep black shine on plastic, rubber, and vinyl car parts. The gentle formula is safe for use on car exteriors, interiors, and even engine bays. Engine bays would be pretty cool. We'll have to try it on one of the vehicles. The Schrabel... Liquid dressing restores a fresh look. New look. Plastic rubber. Protects against UV rays. And then what else? Fading and cracking. It says uh, spreads evenly with a foam applicator or brush over texture bumper plastic. Car tires. Windshield crowls. Large roll. Off roll tires. Rear rubber window moldings. Low profile street tires. Engine bays. It says fender liners, so you can use it inside your fender line, grills, lowers, louvers, and more. Yeah, you can basically buy using it on all your plastic. We'll have to try it out. Today, we're just going to use this on the tires for the Jeep, um, not the plastic. Well, we can do another separate video on the plastic and see. I got to let that B maker wear off a little bit. That's about it. Let's see what else. It says basically tire cooker. It says, work the tire kicker into any vinyl, plastic, and rubber. Buff off any excess. So we can do that. So basically, shape well. Clean surface before application. Spray on the Microsoft towel or applicator. And work into surface. Remove any excess again. So well, let's go try it. Yeah, I'm sitting in a Jeep right now. We got the kids out next door. They're playing. They're making a little bit of noise. That's all right. So I figure come in sitting here and... Be a little bit quiet. It says safe for use on vinyl, rubber, and plastic. So you could probably use it on your rubber trim, around your doors. That'd be nice too. Use that on there. And here you go, tire kicker. But today we're just gonna put it on a tire and see what it likes. I bought this a while ago. We'll try it out. Oh, there. Pulling that cut up from a block. Got Adams. Shake this off. You can spray it on there if you want. A lot of times I use spray. Put a little bit on there. Try not to get on any on the wheels. And then I'll spray some on the applicator. Kind of hard one to hit. Shake it up. It's pretty liquid. It's kind of almost, yeah, it's real. Yeah, it's not thick. It's almost like making up your own with that uh, BRP. From, uh, Yeah, it's pretty thin. It's going on nice. Let's work it in there. Looks like a little goes a long way, huh? Not bad. I, think I bought a dang tire applicator the other day from Chemical Guy's store. I should be out using it. It's in the, it's in the house, still in the bag. <laughs> I'll use it next time. Yeah, if you want to see me use this uh, product on the plastic on the Jeep, let me know in the comments. I'll make a separate video. And then we can see what it looks like on the plastic, if you like. We can. How about we'll go right here. Man, it does shine it up. Can you guys see that? It's going to drive. It's going to rain Tuesday anyway. Look at that. Hopefully you can see it. We'll do right here. Boom. Yeah, not bad. It shines it up. That bee maker is pretty much wearing off on a plastic, I think. But yeah, if you want me to do a separate video on the plastic, let me know. Let me see. There you go. Dang, it does shine up. Oh, they're right. Gives it a extra shiny tire shine. So I think if you like a uh, satin look, this is not going to be it for you. I spray 
a little bit on the tire. I like, so far I like it. Let me see if it smells like anything. It does have a smell to it. Kind of, let me see. It smells like Dove soap. If you ever use Dove, it's body soap. That's what it smells like to me. Yeah, that's what it smells like. <laughs> Dove body soap. There you go. All right, let me. Uh, I'm sure you don't let me. Let me get all the tires on, and we'll let it flash a couple minutes, and we'll let it look like with one coat. All right, keep on watching. First time here, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. We do uh, test out auto detailing products and car shows we tend to in the Detroit area. Make videos of that, swap meets, do a little bit of auto repair in our own vehicles stuff like that if you're in the fox body mustangs we have a, i have a bunch of videos on that some of the parts i used on it and uh well let me continue to go and we'll we'll look at it let me check this spot out right here let's look at that yeah not bad fire kicker been about 10 minutes see him plus do i had to move the vehicle backward a little bit so i get the spot you can't reach but looks like that tire's done. Got a little streaky, but I just did that one. It hasn't flashed. You can see where I just did it. There. And then tomorrow when the wife gets home with it, we'll we'll check it out and see if we get any sling on it anything. Here, here, probably mainly. Man, I did a terrible job cleaning those wheels. Missed half of it. <laughs> but I'll do that tomorrow. Very good. Missed some dirt. I need to, what I'm going to do too is I need to take the wheels off and clean everything. Do a spring clean and, and rotate the tires. And then uh, put the, make it look good. And put some um, a spray on the wheel wells. That's what I look like. Now these are pretty shiny. So if you don't like shiny, real shiny tires, you're not going to want, want this. That do shine pretty good. Hopefully the sun will be out tomorrow when she pulls up and we'll get a better look. See how shiny they are. But that's it right there. Looks pretty good. Okay, you could use it on anyone. Steer, it's steer, everything. So uh, yeah. All right, continue to watch and we'll see what it looks like tomorrow. And at least that way it'll be close to 24 hours of pure time too. And it's not supposed to rain tomorrow. It's gonna be 70 tomorrow. It's supposed to rain Tuesday. So we'll go look at it tomorrow and see uh, what it looks like. Sorry guys. Let's do an update. It's gonna be including with the applying this product. I just locked it lost track of time to do the ending of that video so i might as well do it now um sorry about that so it's i applied the tire shine from chemical guys tire kicker on 4 21 19 april 21st so it's been 15 days it's been on here and plus it's rained last week for five days in a row and then it's going to start raining again tomorrow rain a little bit today but not too much though just little sprinkles but here looks the results from 15 days all you, know, you guys can judge for yourself. Remember, I applied the Kimball Guys Harbor Charge on it. You can see it. You can see a little bit of dirt. It's not on a plastic. So, the tires look to me look pretty clean. Not bad. This one right here. I mean, they're a little bit dirty, but I figure for 15, 15 days and driving in the rain all those days, you can see we're driving. This car's dirty. That's pretty much it, you know. And let me know too, also, if you want me to do a video applying it to all the plastic on the Jeep. Right here. Right there. So that's it for this. Come on, guys. Tire kicker. I give it a thumbs up. I like it. So, yeah, it lasted. So it held up pretty good with the rain. No sling on it at all, as long as you let it dry. Yep. It gives it a little bit of glossy look now, but. Yeah, I like it. It does give it a nice shine. So if you like a set finish, this will not be the one for you. Yeah, let me know if you want it on the plastic. And maybe we'll do it in the, the plastic and the engine will shine it up with this product. Let me know. So, yep. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. I um, appreciate all you guys, my new subscribers, old subscribers, everyone that uh, comments, the regulars and that. Appreciate you guys checking out our videos and spending time with us. And you guys have a great one. Later.